Hi guys, welcome back to my channel F Sheik Excel Master and I am your friend Farah Sheik and today we are going to learn how to remove duplicates from Excel. Why do we need this option remove duplicates from Excel? Well, remove duplicates is an excellent option in Excel where it helps to organize your data in case you receive your data and it has a multiple duplicate values. It is not possible for a human to identify each and every line items and to delete them. So Excel made it in a very easy way by plugging the option remove duplicates in the data ribbon where it is called as remove duplicates under data tools. So where you can organize your data and you can improve the accuracy of your report and you can do various analysis based on your data. So let me quickly show you the example over here we have where I'm going to highlight my range Okay, where I find my duplicate data or even I can highlight the entire column so in this case I will highlight the range and I'm going to select data ribbon and the data tools remove duplicates as soon as I click on remove duplicate it will automatically ask for expand the selection or continue with the selection we're going to see continue with the selection if I click and we're going to see expand selection later on so continue with the selection current selection it will remove the duplicates it will say whether you wanted to identify the duplicates in the column for us no by the way for us is the data which we are identifying it so I need to uncheck my my data has headers so it can take the entire selection and once we select ok great it has removed three duplicates and kept the two unique values in my data so now we are going to talk about the expand selections I will just select the data by selecting control control a that will select my data or I will just select this column and just select this highlight this column and say remove duplicates and this time I'm going to go with expand the selection so once I select expand selection as you have seen Excel has automatically taken column B as well in the consideration of removing duplicates now what are these unselect all and select all well if you select the column based on that specific column it will remove the duplicate suppose if I check first name and last name then you can see only there is one duplicate value which is Faraz shake in the entire data set so if you select ok you see one duplicate value and four unique values so basically it will compare both the columns and then it will delete the duplicate value so we are going to say the last name so I will uncheck the last name and there is only one duplicate value so my data has headers yes it has headers excellent you have seen it has removed one duplicate value so what in case if i have selected the column a which is the first name and i have unchecked the last name then i would have only two unique values that is correct there's only faraz and f shake which was a duplicate value in the data set great so this is a very helpful tool you can just play around over here with multiple data if you have and it can help you the one very important thing which I'm going to show it to you now with the which will help you in the data analysis uh, while removing the duplicate values so I have a same set of data which has one two three four duplicate value but Excel will be not able to identify it as a duplicate because there are leading spaces there are trailing spaces and the leading spaces so in order to clean up your data to organize it so for the analysis purpose so we are going to take the help of the helper column and we are going to write a very simple formula which is a trim formula goes to trim basically trim function will remove the leading and trailing spaces and the additional spaces between your data uh, like suppose F shake Excel master has two spaces it will remove one space and it will organize it so we're going to say trim 
okay excellent and there we go and we're going to copy this data we're going to go on our original data and paste it as value oops and we're going to paste it as a value so now all your trading and the leading spaces are gone same way we are going to use it over here but i'm going to add three four spaces and equals to trim enter excellent let's have seen it has removed the additional spaces and it has cleaned up my data so i'm going to copy it yes great so now we don't need the helper column So now once we select control A and once we select remove duplicates, the first column, first name, excellent, it has given me the correct data. So if you were having these leading spaces, my friends, like in this case, and if I try to remove duplicates, my first name, it would have found only one as duplicate value. Again, we have another few spaces. And again, we go remove duplicate. By the first name, remove duplicates. No duplicates value found because it will consider it will consider this value as a unique value with the spaces. And I hope you have enjoyed this video. So please push a like button, share this video, subscribe to my channel, and don't forget to hit the bell icon. And if there is any queries, you can write it down on my Facebook group page and I will get back to you as early as possible. And a soft copy of this file will be available on my Facebook group page. You can download from there and you can try it by yourself. Signing off for today, your friend Thrashik from FShake Excel Master.